guys, Master Games back with a new video. In this one, I'll be talking about how to get free iTunes music. Um, I know how I haven't had uh, any videos up lately, but this is going to totally make up for that. So what you want to do is go to the internet and Google one of your favorite songs or any song you would like to download for free. Uh, so I'll just do Cross to Bear by Demon Hunter. And what you want to do is go to YouTube for that song. Um, let's pop up here. Alright. So you'll probably have to watch an ad or you can skip it because um, songs get mod uh, monetized, um, which make them have ads. Uh, next, after skipping the ad or whatever, make sure the song is good quality because you don't want to be downloading a piece of crap. Uh, if it is good quality, which I'd suggest probably watching 10 seconds, 20 seconds of it, like and copy the link that comes in the description area. Um, then you want to go to YouTube to MP3 converter. Um, it has to look like the website I'm using, otherwise I can't really tell you what to do. It should just show up on top because it's really popular. Let's just put it that way. So you go to that and then you paste the link into the little tab and you put convert video. Uh, if you haven't downloaded iTunes, you definitely have to do that because there is no point in doing anything else without that. So what you want to do is go to iTunes.com, click the blue download button in the top right-ish corner. Uh, and then you want to press download now in the left side of the screen. Now you don't have to check the bar boxes or put your email address in. You can just download it. Um, and also, there's no guarantee it'll download right for you. It didn't download right on my computer. Uh, I'm just using a different computer right now, so that's why it's working. Um, so once the video's been converted, press download. And it should pop up on the bottom of your screen if you're using Chrome and, I believe, Internet Explorer. And, I think, Firefox, too. Um, then you want to go to iTunes that you just downloaded or um, uh, if you've downloaded it before. So, as you can see, this is all my music. What you want to do is go to the My Music tab uh, that's in the top uh, left-ish. I mean, middle, kind of. Uh, and you can see all the music you got. Then, what you want to do is go to the top left button and add file to library. Uh, then find the file. It'll likely come up like um, with a blue music note on it. It's hard for me to find them. If you have a lot of files, it'll be hard for you too. Um, let's see if I can find it. Uh, where is it? Um... Sorry about that. Oh, there it is. Uh, so you double click that. And it should pop up on the bottom of the music. Then you right click it and press get info. Uh, then you edit the song title, the artist, the album, and the album artist. Um, that's what I'd for sure do. The, this other stuff is optional, but those are the things I would for sure do. Is that artist, the song name, the album, and the album um, artist. Then you can make it the genre in whatever genre you want or whatever it is. Um, I'd suggest that one too, but that's kind of your choice. Uh, then the date, I'd look up on Wikipedia if you want to be right because uh, it's not like we really know that. Unless you're a huge fan of the band, then you might know. But I just go to Wikipedia and let's just see if I was right on that date. It is not 2013, so that, or yeah, it's not 2013, so that's why you check that. Because uh, you can be wrong. Um, so I'll just change that. And then what you want to do is check the track number. So Cross to Bear is number 7 out of 12. So you'd put 7 of 12 in the track. Um, and then you can rate it. I'm just going to rate it um, 5 out of 5, and I love it because it's a really good song. Um, that's optional, of course. You don't have to rate it. Then you go to Artwork tab, and that's why you come to Wikipedia because you have to save the album image. And then save it with whatever name you want. It doesn't matter. And then press Add Artwork. 
and find the picture that you downloaded and there it is and you double click and OK so that, as you can see it's up in the top right there um, now it's in iTunes but that doesn't mean we're done so what you want to do is plug in your iPod iPhone or iTab or which iPad sorry about that can't talk to get talk today um, uh, so that's really easy to do this last part is really easy to do so what you want to do is go to the iPod that pops up or whatever you have that you plugged in um, so you click playlists and then you go to the iPod that show is showing up right now and then you hit music and edit playlist um, once you hit that it should show up on the right side and you just drag and drop the song you downloaded into that little sidebar over there and it should just go on in there let's check it out and voila there it is so that's how you do it and it's really easy and you can get a lot of songs this way I got 45 songs last night doing this and it's free otherwise it would cost $45 last night so it's a really good deal I'm gonna show you one more time just in case if I went too fast or you just would like to see it again so I'm just gonna google another song let me think. Demon Hunter, uh, Heart of a Graveyard, that's a good song. Um, so what you want to go and do is go to YouTube for it. Um, uh, make sh You'll probably have to go through an ad, so just skip it or do whatever you want if you actually want to see it. But after that, you'd want to like the video if it is good quality. If it's not good quality, don't do any of this. Um, so like the video and then copy the link that shows up that is highlighted in blue and then you want to go to MP or YouTube to MP3 converter um, and there it is and then you want to paste it into the little tab and press convert video then you hit download um, it should show up on the bottom and then you go back to iTunes you press the top left button oh wait let me get out of the iPod section really quick sorry about that um, what's going on this is weird you can't add stuff here so I don't know what's going on uh, let me get out of here sorry about that I'll be back when I'm done with this Alright, so you click the top left button, and then you go to the files you have, or you add file to library, that's what you click, and then look for the file that you downloaded. It'll usually pop up with a blue music note, and it'll end up on the bottom. You press get info, and you edit the song title, the artist, the album, and the album artist. That's what I would really suggest, and then probably the genre too. Uh, and then you want to do the, um, uh, year, which I'd suggest going to Wikipedia for, and same with the track I'd go to Wikipedia for, um, cause that stuff you don't, you certainly don't know the track, and you may not know the year, but, and both of those are pretty important. Um, so as you can see, it's number 12 of all 12 songs, so you'd put it 12 of 12 on the track. Uh, then you'd rate it. I'm just going to rate it. Uh, you don't have to do that, but it's... Um, I don't really care if you do it or not. It doesn't mean anything. Then you press Add Artwork and go to the picture that you have. And there it is in Extremist. Um, the Heart of a Graveyard right there. But we are not done again. We have to go to the iPod and Edit Playlist. And... Uh, What's going on? It's not it's showing any of my music. That's weird. I'll just refresh it for you all really quick. And come on. Sorry about that. And okay. Please don't sink. If sinking takes such a long time. And it's probably going to. 
Uh, Alright, so what you want to do is go to the iPod, click My Music, and then Edit Playlist. The little tab thing will show up on the right. And you uh, drag and drop the song you downloaded into that, and it should show up. So, uh, where is it? Uh, begins with a T. I just dragged it in there. That's weird. Uh, come on. Maybe it's because it's syncing the iPod. Um, I'll just refresh it again. Uh, there we go. Uh, okay. This normally never happens, just so you know, so I don't think it's, um, like a problem. I think it's just that it's syncing. Because this never has happened to me yet, so... Where in the heck is it? Oh, there it is. It actually counted out the the. So it's just heart of a graveyard. So that is how you do it. Uh, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. And see you guys later.